Hello again everyone, my name's Alicia. I'm a trainer and an educator. I do apologise, the uh, washing machine's going on in the background, but I am in the kitchen. Um, today is going to be very quick. I promised that we'd have a little update on the seeds and how they're doing, so that's literally what I'm going to do. Um, I do want to show you, um, oops, I want to show you the garlic, uh, which, <laughs> I don't know if you can see that, uh, but it is growing out of its tiny little space in this egg carton. So I think the secret there is make sure that you plant garlics really quite far down in the soil so that they've got room to sprout up with their powerful root system, it appears. But they are coming along really nicely and I think I will plant them out um, and see how they do. Also, we have some amazing um, carrots that are growing, and you can see that uh, just oh, that's broccoli. I'm just going to take this out of the holder a moment so you can see the carrots growing there, and also the cucumbers, which are amazing. And what I've also done, I'm just going to, I'm just going to swatch, switch this, I can't switch it around, I'm just going to try. Um, so I just want to show you these. Now a few days ago I potted these on and they were like the cucumbers, but now they're courgettes, these ones are courgettes, and it's, they're huge. <laughs> Um, there was a little experiment that I did to see a few videos back to see if um, if the broccoli that I'd got growing, of which you can see them all here, uh, to see if they would fare better um, in you know kind of like a greenhouse effect. So we'll have a little look at that one. I think that one is not faring better. I think he looks quite quite bereft quite sad so I think hopefully you can see that so I think we're going to leave him free and not have him in there um to let me see how this one is going to do let's just bring this back ah now in a in a larger container that one seems to be a lot happier you hope that you can see see this he seems to be a lot happier in fact this one does seem to be um, growing better than the ones in in other areas so maybe the key is to have them in bigger spaces and bigger planting things just in a tiny little one and I think also remember that I, I mentioned with the small one I dropped it a few times so it's actually traumatized I wanted to show you this because these are seeds from a very small cherry tomato that I had yesterday. Um, I wanted to um, grow them on. So just from one tiny little cherry tomato, there's probably about 20 plants there or more if I grow them very carefully. So that was a, it's a bit of a, a weird little video, that one, kind of upside down. But... Um, I hope that you enjoyed that. Um, I'm going to do some planting some of these out now. So the next time you see them, they will be in the garden and I will probably shield them, which is a word that uh, we're becoming familiar with. I shall probably shield them for just a little while and put to, uh, to use some of the containers um, from the water that I've been using because um, they make ideal um, little greenhouse shieldy type things. Anyway, um, have a great evening and I'll see you again. Take care. Bye bye.